I did not measure this actually before I bought it. And this looks really big. Will it ever end? No. My hands are purple because we tie-dyed last night with some of my coworkers and stuff. We actually started like a little volleyball league and we tie-dyed little shirts. Well, actually we didn't start. We joined a volleyball league and we play tonight actually. Maybe I'll vlog a little bit of that. That might be fun. I don't know. So yeah, we tie-dyed shirts last night and I did not use gloves. Also, I went to my dermatologist appointment this morning and like my dermatologist walks in, she goes, Marissa! And I was like, my hands are purple. <laughs> and she goes, I didn't... Help. <laughs> well, I just didn't want to like shake her hand with her seeing it and being like, what the fuck is that? So I just wanted to get it out there before I touched her. And she goes, blueberries? And I was like, tie-dye? And she's like, oh. <laughs> um, Cause she's like, I actually just bought a kit for my kids last night. And I was like, well, make sure they wear gloves. <laughs> So that was funny. I did not go to the dermatologist for my purple hands, but it just so yeah, happened. Yeah, she asked if you were there for the purple hands. I could see it on her face, but she didn't ask. <laughs> Cause I immediately switched the subject of like, so I'm just here for a prescription refill appointment. <laughs> not for my purple hands. Hello, I'm sitting here editing and just realizing that like a few of these vlogs for whatever reason, there's some footage missing and I'm basically gonna combine two little vlogs here. So we're gonna hop from this vlog over to an Ikea haul because for whatever reason, all of that footage is missing. So here's the haul from Ikea and then we'll hop back into today because you know, y'all gotta see the new stuff that we got for the apartment. It's so freaking cute. We're back from Ikea, so I'm of course gonna haul everything that we got at Ikea, but I also have a whole bunch of boxes behind me. These are moving boxes, but I have a whole bunch of Amazon boxes behind there and in the hallway. So we might as well just do an entire like apartment haul kind of thing, apartment decor haul, because we got a lot of stuff and I'm really excited about it. I guess we'll start with this. <laughs> so we needed an extra trash can because we went from having a two bathroom to now a two and a half bath. So we needed like a new bathroom trash can. And right now we have have trash cans in the bathrooms of course but they're like open top and I have to set them on top of the toilet so that way Freya doesn't get into them so when we saw these with like an actual lid on it we were like why don't we just get these in general like you might as well just replace all of them oh my god this comes out how convenient. Yeah, so we got this one for the new bath, but then we just decided to get all of them the same. So that way Freya can't get into the trash. And here's the third. They really only had white, this color, and black. I was really hoping they would have like a green color or something, but they did not. And the white was like not a pure white. So we just went with these like taupe colors, I guess you would call them. I like them. I'm excited for them. 10 out of 10 so far. <laughs> We also had to get another little like, you know, toilet bowl cleaner for the third bathroom now. And this, we're not really worried about being fancy because it literally just cleans the toilet. So ain't nothing special about that. Griffin wanted to get new like soap dispenser and a toothbrush holder for his bathroom. So we got them in the same color as the trash can. So that way they could just match in his bathroom. And I didn't want this cause it's like too boring for me. Like I'm trying to go for bright and colorful and stuff. And that's great for his bathroom or rather, I guess the master bathroom I should explain is of course both of our bathrooms. But since we have two bathrooms, upstairs ones in my office and one is in the bedroom so like I just claimed my office one and that's when I'm gonna make like cutesy and fun and colorful and stuff and then the master bathroom is the one that like you know is the normal bathroom so in my bathroom I got this set because I thought it was much cuter than the other set and it's this little like blue glass set I just think that's so cute and it comes with a little cup so you can put your toothbrush and stuff in here and your toothpaste I just thought this was so much cuter so I went with this also got two little suction cup hooks for the bathroom because we needed somewhere in this new bathroom to kind of like hang up our you know loofahs and stuff so it's like the most basic little suction cup and then it just you know has these little hooks that go on to it bada boom bada bam and then you can hang your loofah on it so got two of those so that way one can go in my bathroom which is where i'll be showering the office bathroom and then one in the master i also got these towels for the kitchen because i thought they were so fun i say this time and time again but we're just aiming for color like not that i'm not hoping to match things but i just feel like if you just have so much color then it'll match you know what i mean so i just got this fun set of like hand towels for the kitchen that i think are adorable so we have this one this one which is like one of each of them. So, you know, foreshadowing to what the other ones are. This one, love it. And a cute little like lemon one. And I just think they're so freaking cute. I just think they're fun, they're colorful. And why would you not want, you know, fun and colorful in your kitchen or just in your space period? So these are adorable. I'm really excited for those. And then we got these little placemats for our dining room table, which are also super fun and colorful. They're just like a little pastel-y, rainbow-y kind of, at least color scheme. But of course it's not like rainbow. And this will sit at our little dining room table. And I just think they're so 
cute. And then that way everything's just like colorful. Griffin really wanted to get a new set of like, I don't know even what to call these. I guess they're like little glass pourers. We have these sitting next to the oven, but they're different of course. And they pour out like, you know, oil and vinaigrette and stuff like that for cooking. And he liked the way that these look and they look really easy to change out and stuff in terms of like filling them. The ones we have now are a pain to refill. So we got those. Griffin and I also eat a lot of sushi and I've said that I'd love to have like our own chopsticks. So we just found these at Ikea and we decided to get them just so we would have some reusable chopsticks while we're here at home and stuff like that. I'd love to get an actual like nice, nice pair, like a metal pair or something, but I'm still kind of excited to have these ones. I think that's fun. I also got this little plant hanger. I don't know where I'm going to put it yet, but it'll definitely go in the office somewhere. And I'm really freaking excited to just add some, you know, color around some greenery rather. And then we got this little like standing charcuterie board. It's obviously like a cutting board, but we're going to use it as a charcuterie board. Or honestly, I'll probably use it for like decoration and stuff because it looks really cute. So big fan of this. And I got this bag that I'm really excited for to obviously use for shopping and stuff like that. And then the last thing that we got from Ikea is this. You can't really tell what it is in this package, but I'll post a picture of it up here. It's this little like rack, of course, that, you know, mounts to the wall and that way you can like hang stuff on it. And I plan to use it to hang up my like tote bags and like purses and stuff. I really want it on this wall, like right behind here, like next to my closet door. I think that'll fill like that little small area well and I'll have a place to put all my tote bags and stuff like that. So I got this and that finishes up the Ikea haul. So I guess let's do this. This is gonna make a mess. I hate styrofoam. I did not measure this actually before I bought it. And this looks really big. Oh crap. I don't even know if it's gonna fit on my desk. Essentially I got this little riser shelf for my desk. So that way my computer can like sit up on a ledge and I'll have more like storage on my desk. But I don't know if that's gonna fit. Ooh, we're gonna have to figure that out and hope that it fits. Oh my God, there's cork legs. Interesting. I was literally just watching like an office tour on YouTube and this girl had that and I just immediately went to her description and clicked buy on the link without measuring it. So let's hope that works out. We have more Amazon stuff. Well, this one's not apartment related at all. We just needed more poo bags for Freya. So finally those came in. Can I say though, actually this box, I will link them down below, literally has, let's say, it says 1,080 bag refills. There's 60 rolls in here. Has lasted us over a year. Like again, Freya turned a year in January and we just recently ran out. So that's pretty great. I want to get a printer in here because there's just things that I'm gonna need to start printing and stuff. And I don't have a printer, but I also wanna be able to organize like papers and stuff. So I got this little doohickey. It's literally nothing special. I'm just excited because it's colorful, but it's just a little two tier purple paper tray of sorts. And so I'll have to put it together, but of course they like sit on top of each other. And I just thought the color was really pretty. And again, just gives and adds color to my space. So I'm here for it. So we had to get a new shower curtain or rather I wanted to get a new shower curtain for the master bath because after a year that thing was disgusting. So yeah, I got a new shower curtain. I guess I should open it right now. My bathroom here in the office is a glass sliding door, so I don't need one, but I just got a little like, there's no picture of it, but it's literally just white and you don't need the rings for it. It just kind of snaps in on the rod and it has like a snap in liner, if that makes sense. Alexis had one in her apartment when I went down to Florida and I liked it. Like I usually hate curtains, which is why I always prefer a sliding glass door just because I hate when the thing like touches you or like when you're showering and the curtain like sucks to you. Absolutely hate it. Hers didn't do that. And I think it was because it was this kind of like liner. Cause it's like linen. I don't know how to explain it. I don't know, but I just bought it because I liked hers. And if I would ever shower in a shower curtain, I'd rather be that one. Next, I also ordered Griffin new bath mats for his bathroom. So I just got navy blue. I thought that'd be really nice and like sleek with the white shower curtain and stuff. And then I got little fake plants. I thought ahead, or at least like I knew that I would want some. I want more and stuff. But then when I was at Ikea today, that's why I got this. I'm gonna put the little like droopy plants that I ordered on Amazon in here. That's my plan. At least from the photo, they looked pretty like long and I'm hoping full. Oh, these are, oh, these are really long. Okay, well, I was not expecting like this long. What am I supposed to do with them? Well, let's pretend for a moment. Okay, that's not like as bad as, I'll, I'll fluff them out. They need to be like separated and stuff, but really long, we'll go with it. <laughs> I already opened this one because something else was in the box that I was trying to get to, but I ordered some cable management for my office here just to kind of like help make it look pretty. And so it was a set of three. Essentially, they're all 
in here, but they all look exactly the same. There's just like a white box with a little like wood lid. And so obviously there's more in it, but essentially you just put your extension cord inside and there's little holes on the side here that, you know, the cord goes through and then all your cords can come out. And it's just a really good way to hide the cords or like your extension cord rather. So yeah, I just ordered like a little set of three. So we can use one under my desk, one over here where I have a lot of extension cords and then, I don't know, use the third one somewhere else. This one is super fun. I'm so excited for it. As soon as I saw it on Amazon, I had to buy it because I also wanted to get new bath mats for myself and, and this little bathroom here, and this is the one that I got. Ah, look how cute that is. This looks so good. Oh, and it's so, oh, I love it. I love it. Big fan. Oh my gosh. So yeah, this will be in my bathroom. I love it. That is all the Ikea and Amazon stuff. These two big boxes are actually two accent chairs that I got for my office to go on this wall here because we got rid of the futon and I wanted to get accent chairs instead. So, but I'm not gonna put those together right now. I literally do not feel like it. And now I've made a huge mess that I have to clean up. But I'm so excited for all this stuff. This is so fun. I think it's gonna look so good. I'm so excited to just finally get everything like together. I feel like most people finish their work day on Fridays at like 4 or 5 p.m. You know, everybody gets off early, but it's almost 7 and I could keep working. I have plenty of things to do, but I'm gonna stop mainly because I have to because like I mentioned, we started like a little volleyball league, my tie-dye, and we have a volleyball game tonight. So I need to get ready because we play at 8 and we want to all meet over at like the place at 7. So I have 10 minutes to get over there and I kind of want to change. Actually, no, because they're bringing the tie-dye shirts. So one of our teammates, my coworkers, Allie, she took all the shirts home last night so that she she could wash them all and you know help us all out because some of us worked and stuff like that so she's gonna bring all the shirts tonight i did say i would bring scissors let me not forget that but i want to kind of gather a towel because we go swimming afterwards to get all the sand off of us we're still trying to get all this together but i feel like this is sufficient i just need a random towel i do need to put my baby suit on so baby okay we're ready. I have a way bigger bag than I need. I guess when I have to like, you know, change, change. I can throw my clothes in there. Freya's like going crazy. You're not coming. I'm so sorry. You can't come. Look at her. So sad. Oh, Griffin got our bikes hung up today. Sorry, my AC is blasting because it's 91 degrees outside. At least that's what my car says. Oh, I was just about to say I forgot a hair tie, but there was one sitting on my little prindle. So we're good. All of our shirts. I don't know which shirt's mine though. I'm sure Allie knows. I don't know. I don't think mine was this light. I did all pastel colors. This one's Adrian's because I made hers. This one's Eric's. Look how it turned out. I don't know why I didn't take on the back at all, but I like the front. That looks so cool. You forgot the scissors? I did. I'm so sorry. Mine has a lot more yellow than I thought I put on it. Like, I don't remember putting yellow in here. Did you get Mark's too or Mule's? Did she ask you what tequila you wanted? No. Can I taste yours? Yes. Mine tastes like shit. Hers better than yours. Exactly. Exactly. What is that? Mine's also a different color than yours. What did she do? I'm gonna like put it over here in the corner, but then we're gonna like whack it with the ball. <laughs> okay, wish us luck. Exhausted, we're tired. Uh, my back kind of hurts from carrying the weight of the team, but it is okay. I put my trust in them, and we still put off a loss, but it's, it's totally fine. They pulled off a loss? I mean, we did pull off a loss. We lost all three games. So every time we play someone, you play like three different sets. We lost all three. But we were better than last week, and that's all that matters. That is all that matters. Oh, I couldn't vlog when I was playing, but I did a really big dive for the ball, and my fucking ribs hurt. Imagine diving, couldn't be me. I'm too pretty for that. I was saying that earlier. 
see, I'm not gonna jump for the ball and like fall on the floor. I'm not about to do all that. I'll get on my knee, but I, I will do it for the team. But it fucking hurt. I well, that, that was my first ever dive, so it hurt really bad. And then I was like, oh, I'm not doing that again. But I did dive, and it fucking hurt. So it's okay. But now it's time to swim. <laughs> I hope y'all like this little combined vlog that, I don't know, feels like a little Frankenstein-esque because it, yeah, kind of choppy. Bear with me, I'm so very sorry. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I love you guys so much and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.